Hi guys, when you are filming a toddler gift haul and your toddler just nearly walks in. <laughs> oh, it's all good, he's gone back to sleep. Bless him. If you hear coughing children as well, both boys have got coughs and it's just horrendous. I'm really sorry about my hair. I've got some serious like bum hair going on. Mum, that was mum, not bum. I've got a cold. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Rosie and I am mum of two boys. Saxon is three and Ezra is 20 months. So both are preschoolers, toddlers. I thought I'd show you what I've bought my boys this year for Christmas. We're not the kind of people to go crazy at Christmas. I think we try and keep things as minimal as we can. The first thing I got for Saxon is a bit of a funny one, but basically any time we went into a toy shop that had VTech toys, but VTech is a really um, kind of plasticky baby range of toys, um, and they make noise, and if you're a parent you know exactly what I mean. Um, Saxon has had an obsession with this one particular toy, the VTech Pop and Play Elephant, um, and you pop the balls in here, and you turn it on, I'm only gonna do it really quickly. Why do I do this to myself? The balls pop up and it plays music and they spin down into the elephant and go all along here. And these make little notes, these little jobbies, buttons. Um, and it's kind of like learning, but it's a baby toy. But Saxon has wanted this for like a year. Every time we go into a shop, he's like, my elephant slide. So um, I thought we'd buy it, but I don't know how long he'll play with it, and it was like 25 quid brand new, so we bought it off eBay um, for I think six or eight pounds or something, um, and we just went and picked it up. So eBay is amazing for bargain, last minute toy finds, go and order second hand toys. It's also really good to buy things second hand as well because it's just less waste and less money. Um, and then this is Little Arlo that I bought for Ezra because he's really into dinosaurs and we love the good dinosaur and this is the main character from it um, and this was 9.99 um, and I just know he's going to love that, it's going to be something that he kind of takes around everywhere, we'll obviously take the tag off. Um, but they're the kind of like, I don't want to say main presents but <laughs> the bigger things. Um, and then we've just got a few little bits really. As I say, we don't have loads. So the next thing I got them were these orchard toys. This is a puzzle with four different ones in and each puzzle gets slightly harder so it'll be good for the ages. Saxon can do this one with him and Ezra can do this one on his own. Um, and we love orchard toys games. Saxon has like a shopping game that he absolutely loves. And then this one I got for Saxon, and um, it's got opposites, it's a matching puzzle, um, and this one is a very dirty bear, and this one is a very clean bear, so I thought that'd be quite good to teach him how to, um, to know opposites, and um, yeah, I think he'll really enjoy that. I'm really sorry about my voice, by the way. The steel household has been plagued for like a week with bug and cold. The next thing I bought them, this is going to be just for them both, is this... <laughs> incy wincy spider book and you put your fingers in the back and it's um a little creepy spider i know it is a bit creepy but this is right up my boy's street anything puppets or silly or fun they just love so um i know they're gonna love it and actually they were there when i bought it and sax was like please can i hold it so i've got four of these paw patrol characters um He's already got the other three, so I ordered these from eBay again. Um, so he's got Everest, Zuma. Oh, Chase has fallen out. Chase and Sky. And, um, yeah, so as I said, he's got three of the pups. He's got Ryder and he's got these. If you're a mum of boys, you will know what the heck I'm talking about when I say those names. If you're not, good for you. The next things I have got, um, which is the last. Is that the last? No, kind of. Um is I got Ezra these but I know they'll both love them and it's some little foam numbers and letters and, and again like more another educational kind of but fun thing it says three plus we're obviously going to be with him in the bath <laughs> and then pretty much one of the last things is this sticker pack it's a novelty sticker activity pack and it's got these like stickers I don't know if you can see they've got water in them um 
which they are going to go down well. They're probably going to get stuck on furniture and stuff, aren't they? He's going to love them. And he went to see Finding Dory at the cinema. Um, so I, with my sister, so I know he's going to love getting these. Another thing, these aren't really presents, but I'm going to put them in their stockings, which I haven't really included stocking stuff in this because it's generally just little like. things like this and then the last things are these and um, I just yeah I just wanted to show you these they're by humble brush and they're little toothbrushes and this is gonna sound really weird and you'll be like Rosie you bought your kids toothbrushes for Christmas but they're little wooden brushes and I just thought they are so blooming cute for every sold toothbrush we will donate the equivalent amount of one to people in need buy one give one so we thought that was really good and they're made out of panda panda friendly bamboo naturally antibacterial and i actually bought one for me and john as well because you know we need to have matching as a family of course and then the last thing i wanted to show you guys is what i will be wrapping their presents in um we bought this from audi it's 99p and saxon chose this because it is again finding dory and um what else can I say? It's wrapping paper with fishes on it. He's gonna like. So that is all I've got my boys for Christmas. There's nothing big so f big really. I'm sure they will get loads and loads of things. And um, we also recently bought them a kitchen from Ikea, which I showed on Instagram. So if you guys wanna go see that, then go check me out on Instagram. Um, it's Flower Metal, I'll leave a link below. And thanks so much for watching. You're all so lovely. Mwah. Happy Christmas.